Let's find out about mushrooms. Autumn is the season for mushrooms. You can see them at other times of year, but they like the cool, damp weather of autumn. Mushrooms are rather unusual plants. Have you noticed? They do not have green parts to them. Other plants have green leaves to help them to make food. Mushrooms do not need to make their own food as they feed off other things like rotting wood. Flowering plants have fruits. In the fruits are the seeds so that each plant can grow more of its own kind. Mushrooms do not have flowers. So do they have seeds? Yes, they do. Only we don't call them mushroom seeds. We call them spores instead. Spores. Let's look at the kind of mushroom you can buy in the shops. It has a stem and a cap. Under the cap are the gills. You might have to peel a bit away to see them if you have a closed cut mushroom. Inside the gills are the spores. How do I know? Well, you can see them if you do a simple little experiment. First, cut the stalk off close to the gills. Then, place the cap face down on a sheet of white paper. Thirdly, place it somewhere where it won't get disturbed and cover it with a glass bowl. Fourthly, leave it overnight. Next morning, take away the glass bowl and gently lift the mushroom. You should be rewarded with a mushroom spore print. The spores look like a very fine dust, but each one could grow into a new mushroom. There are lots of different kinds of mushrooms. This is a bracket fungus. It lives on the bark of trees feeding from the tree. It is called a bracket fungus as it looks like a bracket. These are puffballs. They are my favourite kind of mushroom. The spores are not in gills but in the ball of the mushroom. If they are knocked, then puff! Out come the spores to be spread around like smoke coming out of a chimney. Be a nature explorer. Look out for mushrooms while you're out and about, but don't touch them as some are very poisonous. Take photos and draw pictures of them in your nature diary when you get back home and try and find out the names of each kind you find. Happy hunting! Key Stage 1 Nature Helping children to learn science through the natural environment.